Hi, Todd Warren here in the Forecast Center with a look at our weather week ahead. And you can see on this Black Friday, a mixture of sunshine and some high clouds across the Arklatex. As we have seen more of the clouds over the southern half of the area, you can see the mostly clear sky right now over Texarkana. As far as the overall pattern, this is what we're watching. Another disturbance off to our west uh, that is uh, going to uh, increase the clouds across all of the Arklatex tonight and also give us a possibility for some rain as this disturbance gradually moves towards uh, the east here in the next 24 hours. So this is how it'll look here as we check out with Robin's Toyota Futurecast. You can see that tonight. Uh, we're going to be looking at the clouds gradually rolling in probably well after midnight over especially the southern half of the area. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy over most of the Arkletex. Notice the area of rain spreading into East Texas and Northwest Louisiana late in the day. That area of rain will continue to move towards the uh, east and eventually fall apart as we go through Saturday night. Might have a lingering sprinkle early Sunday morning, but for the most part, sunshine will quickly return and we will see the beginnings of a warming trend come Sunday and by the middle part of next week. Temperatures more than likely will be back up into the 70s. As far as rainfall potential, it does look like we could see a good half an inch of rain over the southern sections of the Arkletex. You can see down towards center, Manny uh, could see amounts approach a half an inch. Northern half of the area, don't expect much as the rain, if you see any, uh, looking very, very light at this time. And that could be the case as far north as Shreveport, or as far south as Shreveport, I should say, as well. Now, longer range, what's going to happen is once this disturbance clears, we're going to see a drier weather pattern settle back into the area. Here's a look at the disturbance approaching the area during the course of the next 24 hours. Once this moves by, the northwesterly flow will reestablish itself. And you can see the upper level ridging, big old upper level ridge here across the southwestern quarter of the country is going to expand eastward. That will warm us up. And then we will see another disturbance give us a possibility for some rain as we look ahead to probably next Friday night. Right now, it looks like to be the time frame that the rainfall chances will be highest. And again, it does look like this is going to be relatively light as far as the amount of rainfall that we receive. And then we're going to be looking at a kind of a chill down heading into next weekend with uh, temperatures uh, falling back to below normal levels, especially by the end of the weekend. So your forecast for tonight, uh, looking partly cloudy as we'll start to see the clouds increase a bit late tonight. Temperature wise, so we'll bottom out in the upper 20s to middle 30s across the northern sections of the region where we do not see anything as far as clouds. 29 in both Idabel and Dequeen tonight, 36 in Shreveport, 35 in Texarkana, 35 degrees also for the low temperature in Natchitoches. Temperatures tomorrow should recover back into the 50s as uh, he, actually the warmest temperatures northern part of the area which should be close to 60. 59 tomorrow in both Texarkana and Shreveport. We'll see 59 in Natchitoches, 58 in Center and notice the rainfall chances. Not much during the day tomorrow north southwestern sections of the area you're looking at that 40 to 50 percent shot uh, for some rainfall and those chances will go up somewhat heading into and through uh, tomorrow night. And then we start that dry and warmer week ahead. As we look at your 10-day forecast, you can see that temperature Sunday back up into the low to middle 60s, mid to upper 60s Monday, low 70s by Tuesday and Wednesday, mid 70s to close out next week. And then that next cold front approaches, giving us the shot for some rain. Slight chance Friday increases Friday night and any leftover rain will likely end Saturday. And you can see the cool down behind that uh, Friday night system as highs will retreat down close to 60. Overnight lows will fall back into the 30s and 40s. So all in all, it looks like a little bit of rain possible late Saturday and Saturday night. And then a pretty nice week ahead as we go through next week.